Hey everyone, I'm back. I wanted to show, as I had promised, the um, dried versions of the pourings that I had done for the last video. That's video number two. Um, so this is the canvas, and it's not a bright color, but that's not a bad thing because you can use it, you know, to put maybe vinyl on. I've seen some really nice things, um, you know, done by some of the other artists. So it's darker than I would like, but it's still good. This would look really good with um, maybe gold or silver or a holographic vinyl. Um, so I'll probably be showing this in a future uh, video with the, um, the pattern that I cut for this. And this is the the uh, Dollar Tree candle holder. And so what I did was, if you look back at video number two, uh, you'll see where I had inverted it like this over the top of this canvas and poured it. And you can see the pattern there. I was very happy with it. It was more vibrant when the color started out. You can see right there. I love that green. And then on the inside, can't really, you know, pick it up that well, as of course you would be able to in uh, real life if you were here, but it's a really nice result. You can do a lot of things with this too. You can use it as a candle holder. Um, you could also put like um, maybe some um, accessories for your hair, um, you know, like a, a brush, a comb, bobby pins. Um, it could be a match holder. It could be all kinds of things. So that's a really neat thing there. Those aside. Now the very first video that I did was this acrylic pouring on this tile. And this is a, I believe it's a 12 by 12. And I promised and I didn't get a chance to show it in the last video because I went a little bit long. But you can see it there. I'm going to use uh, Liquitex to finish this off. But this is the this is the dried version here. Now before I got started um, videotaping these, I had initially done some others. So they these were never videotaped, but just wanted to show you some projects that I'd done previously. Um, again, what I did here was this is just a bottle and I inverted it and I poured my paint um, and I used ratios very similar to what I had mentioned last time uh, with Floetrol, with acrylic paint, water, and a little bit of silicone. And this was the result here. You could finish this off with some string, you know, maybe some vinyl, um, some bling. I've seen people uh, do all kinds of things with this. I just hadn't decided what I wanted to do with it. And the same day that I did that, uh, this was the tile that was beneath it. Sorry, I keep bumping the camera there. But you can see the color scheme is almost identical because I used the same paint. Now I'd also done some tiles, and this is when I was really into uh, some of the, the black and the blue and the white. And actually, this one here is one that my son did. So I wanted to show you that. And then, this was one that I did. And I had also had a album. Yeah, this was the album that I did. And then there were some, just a couple more here. Um, I really like this one. This one, it was a standalone. Uh, there, there's no other uh, paint that I poured that day. So this tile, this is the only, um, this is the only artwork that I created using uh, the pouring that I did that particular day. Okay. And last but not least, again I'd gotten this. In this case, this is a vase, uh, came from Dollar Tree, 
just like that candle holder. So everything there is a dollar and inverted it and poured the paint over the top. And there it is there. Spin it around so you can look at it a little bit. You can, you know, use it as it was intended as a vase. You can put dried flowers in it, fresh cut flowers. You can do just about anything. Your imagination is the only limitation there. And then this was um, a tile that I had created the same day using the, um, the runoff from it. I really like that, those colors. So these two were companion pieces. So that's it for today. Hopefully I'll be back uh, in the near future uh, with some more um, artwork. And I appreciate everyone for tuning in and watching my videos and supporting my channel. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.